We have some showers for the weekend and a really big high coming for next week. Hi, I'm Philip Duncan. Thank you for joining us for our weekend weather update and the outlook into next week. And we kick off with Friday's animated wind map. Some areas have subtropical breezes coming down. That's why Friday has been fairly mild. Friday afternoon is going to be fairly mild in many regions too, but there is that cooler change just moving up towards Cook Strait by around about this evening. So it's not a major change, but it does bring in a cooler change behind that warmer nor'wester. So by Saturday, you can see the winds are still coming in from the northwest for a time, but as this area of low pressure and rain moves up the country, you'll find that you'll get a cooler change coming later on as well, maybe not until overnight. Now there is not a lot of energy on this map. While we do have a bit of a breeze coming down over the North Island, the South Island's got very light winds, which means as we go into Sunday, uh, you'll find that the weather is a little bit messy, it's a little bit fickle, there's no real energy pushing things around, and so a little bit of a breeze maybe around central areas, but this area of low pressure, very weak, but it might just bring in a few showers, same story up here to the north, weak, but might bring in a few showers and cloudy areas. So it's not the best forecast to lock in precise timing, uh, keep up to date with your local 10 day forecast for that, and the hourly forecast within it. Sunday does look a little messy, but overall it is drier for most places. Now we get into next week, it is dry on the North Island and warm on Monday. Subtropical breezes again for some in the very north, otherwise you've just got a west to northwest wind which in itself is mild anyway. So the eastern side is mainly dry, some rain and showers though for the west coast and Southland and maybe even getting into Otago later on for you. Now on Tuesday that area of rain moves up the country and it falls apart as it moves into the North Island. So you'll get a period of either showers or patchy rain coming through, then the cooler south to southwest change behind it, leaving a few showers just here and there. But it all sets us up for Wednesday. And once Wednesday arrives, this enormous high from Australia at this stage is likely to move in on Wednesday next week and linger with New Zealand right through until Sunday, the following weekend. So that's to about September 22nd. So that's quite a good period of dry, sunny weather. There might be a few little showers around the outer edges of it. You can still see on Wednesday, a bit of that cooler southeasterly moving up the North Island, but elsewhere the westerlies are down here in the south, and when you track the origins, it's coming out of the Australian side and partially subtropical. So I think we're going to find next week, might have cooler nights, but I think the days are going to warm up quite nicely. That is all from me. Have a great weekend. We'll see you again on Monday.